Hey everybody, it's Lee and Grandma Jean with Gnome and Backyard. And on our live yesterday, we were talking about toilet paper pumpkins. Yes, we were. So we decided to do a quick, short, pre-recorded video for you to show you how we take our Dollar Tree toilet paper and turn them into some really cute pumpkins. Now at Dollar Tree, you can get four rolls of bathroom tissue in this pack. They are a little bit smaller, but you know what? They're actually really, really a nice size for what we want to use them for as accessories in our bathrooms. Or you could actually use them for accessories anywhere throughout your house. So you get four uh, rolls of tissue paper for $1.25 at the Dollar Tree. Then we found this beautiful sunflower fabric at the Dollar Tree, also for a dollar and a quarter. It's the perfect size, exactly what we need for this project. There may even be a little bit too much, so if you do want to cut it a little bit shorter so you have a little bit of fabric left off, by all means you can do that. But I'm going to show you how we like to do our toilet paper pumpkins. Grandma, can I have the roll? Why, certainly. <laughs> You're just gonna place your roll of toilet paper right in the middle of your fabric. And then you are just going to start bringing all of the ends in. And you're just gonna fold it oh. really sweet like that. You just keep going around in a circle, stuffing your ends in the center, and you get a nice, cute little crease there. So we are going to just keep stuffing and stuffing. All right. Again, there is a little extra fabric here, but you know what? I want it, I'm using it all just to make this project very simple. Very simple. So no cuts or anything. Okay. Oh, Guys, how cute is this, especially with the sunflower pattern? I'm absolutely loving this. Now, what we're going to take to make a stem is we are just going to take some burlap ribbon, we have this, this is from Hobby Lobby. We have a nice roll of that. And we just cut ourselves off a little six inch piece and we're just gonna roll it. We're doing a lot of rolling here with these rolls <laughs> roll of toilet <laughs> tissue. So guys, we're just gonna roll it so that you have a little bit of um, a cute little stem like this. And we are just popping it right down in the center. Oh, wow. We're not even going to hot glue it because you never know when you might need an extra roll. So we're not going to hot glue anything so that you can actually use this project if you need to. <laughs> yeah. So how sweet is that? Oh, nice. We have a, a cute little, bit little of green, a cute little burlap stem. So now Grandma Jean wants to add a little bit of greenery to the project. Oh, so this is just some extra greenery we had in our craft stash and again we're not going to hot glue anything okay so we just pushed our greenery right down there into the center and again no glue because just in case someday you need to use what's underneath here by all means it's going to be ready for you look how absolutely sweet this is and especially is cute. the sunflowers for fall yes. so here's another piece of fabric that we did get from Dollar Tree. It's very pretty. It's a beautiful burnt orange color. I love and it that. Has some tan polka dots on it. So again, we just did the same thing. And now we're gonna take some green ribbon, some green burlap ribbon, just folding it in upon itself as our stem. We are just stuffing it down into the center of our roll. And a little bit of something else. And we're gonna add some Spanish moss too. Just a little bit of Spanish moss. And again, we're not gluing anything in. It'll sit nice on your shelf. Look how cute oh, that, that is. Oh, that is cute. I love that. I love the color. It will just stay really cute. You don't have to glue a thing. How sweet is that? And then, of course, we have Halloween coming up. So we did want to do one for the kids' bathroom. So yes. we found this really cute, spooky fabric at the Dollar Tree. Again, it has jack-o'-lanterns, witches, cobwebs on it, and we did the same thing. So we're just gonna take a little bit of burlap as a stem again. Our burlap ribbon, if you use a smaller piece like this, all you need to do is just, again, roll it around, roll it in on itself. This burlap does have wire um, on it, so I do like the fact that it is a wire ribbon. So we're just folding it back and forth on itself, and then we are going to push it right down into the center. And then we took some green ribbon and did the same thing to make a little leaf. 
and let's see. Add a little color. Oh, that is cute. That How is so cute, cute is that? For so a children's bathroom. Children's bathroom. I love this in my bathroom because Halloween is my favorite season. Yes. Again, I hope you all get the chance to craft yourselves up some of these adorable toilet tissue pumpkins. Thank you so much for continuing to sprinkle Gnome and Backyard and have a wonderful day.